very soon. The county is actually sending out property tax statements on February 14th, and homeowners from Tacoma and all throughout Pierce County are about to see price increases that they haven't seen in years. At the Pierce County Assessor's Office, the phone rings, and the question is a familiar one. How much are my property taxes going up? So the total amount due is 4900 We get thousands of calls and texts. Pierce County Assessor Treasurer Mike Lonergan says the 2020 tax increase is unlike anything he's seen. So I've been here seven years, and uh, this is the largest increase in most districts that I've seen. In Puyallup, Edgewood, Stillicum, and DuPont, taxes on the average will rise by 4 to 9 percent. Tacoma and Gig Harbor will see taxes go up an average of 14 percent. Lakewood, University Place, Spanaway, and Fircrest are looking at roughly 20 percent increases. Well, there is sticker shock, and uh, people tend to first say, why did you raise my taxes? Lonigan says it all goes back to the McCleary decision, the state Supreme Court's judgment that Washington was not properly funding education. To fix that problem, the state legislature cleared the way for schools to increase their local school enrichment levies from $1.50 per $1,000 of property value to two fifty. The double-digit increases are in those places where the local school districts did uh, increase to the two fifty level. On top of that, a 30 cent tax that the state suspended last year has been reinstated. The state legislature exercised its power to add a second state school tax as well, and uh, this is the result that we're seeing. Tacoma resident Juan Garnica told us he doesn't mind the tax hike because it's going to a good cause. Well, I believe that schooling is the only thing we got, you know, and uh, if we need to give them more money, then give them more money. I don't think it's necessary. But Georgia Pope came to the assessor's office armed with some questions about her tax increase. She says as a senior, money is already tight. The utilities go up, food has gone up so drastically. This, she says, will only make matters worse. It is one more thing. Property taxes will be due at the end of April and again at the end of October. Lonergan says there is some good news. He says it's likely that this will be the last time that we'll see property taxes fluctuate so drastically in the coming years. Live in Tacoma, Kristen Ayers, King 5 News.